Madame Gazelle? They are. Ooh. But do not worry, children. There are no volcanoes close by. Hooray! Except the little pretend ones that we are going to make for today's very special science experiment. Oh. We will make our volcanoes using glue and newspaper. Like this. First, you dip the paper in the glue, and then you stick it all to the beaker, and voila! A volcano! Everyone is enjoying making their volcanoes. The glue is very sticky and messy. <laughs> and soon, they are all finished. <laughs> Wonderful, children! Now it is time to paint your creations. <laughs> Let's make ours red, Peppa. Ours can be blue. blue. Green, like a big tree. Real volcanoes are dark and grey with red lava. <laughs> but Peppa and her friends are making their mini volcanoes bright and colourful. Now it is time for the science experiment. But first, everyone must put on special gloves, glasses and coats to make sure they are safe. You all look like wonderful scientists, children. Now we are ready to make lava. <gasps> but do not worry. The lava we are making is just pretend and very safe. Phew! <laughs> First, we add some vinegar to our volcanoes. Be careful not to spill. Uh, uh, mm. Perfect. And now, I will add a secret magic ingredient to each of your volcanoes. Nobody knows what the special magic ingredient is. Finally, take your cup of baking soda and pour a little inside the volcano. Then stand back. Madame Gazelle's volcano is erupting, just like a real volcano. Your turn, children. Hooray! <laughs> wow! The lava is red. Ours is blue. Candy Cat and Gerald Giraffe's lava is green and very foamy. Lava. No, Candy. You made a muddy puddle. Everyone loves making volcanoes, but everyone really loves making colourful muddy puddles. Ah, almost got you. Peppa is trying very hard to open a piñata <laughs> and get the treats inside because today Peppa's playgroup are learning about a Mexican holiday called Cinco de Mayo. Oh, children, we need more decorations for the classroom to make the class look extra uh -huh. happy. So let's make some pom-pom flowers. Pom-pom. <laughs> I like that word. Pom-pom. Just attach the cardboard stem to the middle of the ball of tissue paper and voila. Wow. I will help you. Uh, <laughs> mm, this is tricky. Oh, dear. <laughs> Everyone has made a lot of pom-pom flowers. Well, did we make too many? Of course not. Now our classroom <laughs> looks extra, extra happy. Next, we're going to make some delicious guacamole. Guacamole. Mooly? Guacamole. Mm. It's a Mexican treat made of avocados. And you eat it with carrots or cucumber <gasps> or special crisps called tortillas. Oh. Guacamole. <laughs> guacamole. 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 <laughs> Madame Gazelle is peeling an avocado and adding some lime juice and salt to the bowl. Now we just need to mash it all together. <laughs> oh, 
Oh! Mmm! Guacamole! Whoop. Would anyone like to try some guacamole? Yes, please. Mmm! Delicious! Mm. Mm. Yummy guacamole! Mm. Yummy guacamole! <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful, Peppa! Another way to celebrate Cinco de Mayo is to sing! Yummy guacamole! Yummy guacamole! Yummy guacamole! And dancing is another important part of Cinco de Mayo. <laughs> Pepper has hit the piñata and all the sweets are pouring out. Pepper is enjoying her first Cinco de Mayo and really enjoying. Hello, everyone. I'm Pepper, the dentist. I'll help you look after your teeth. Whoa! Today, Miss Rabbit has come to teach Peppa's playgroup about teeth. Peppa is pretending she is a dentist. <laughs> Got you. For you. Thank you, Peppa. Well, now that you've caught your teeth, <laughs> who knows what we can do to look after them? Um. um. <laughs> Go to the dentist. That's right. Who has been to the dentist before? Me, 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 me! Gerald Giraffe has not been to the dentist before. Can I show Gerald what it's like at the dentist, Miss Rabbit? I've been lots of times. What a great idea! <laughs> Peppa is pretending she is the dentist and Gerald is the patient. Hello, Mr Gerald. Please sit on this enormous chair. <laughs> Thank you, Mrs. Dentist. Here is your apron. <laughs> <gasps> Why do I need glasses, Mrs. Pepper? For this big light. Please open wide, like this. Ah! Uh, so I can see your teeth. Ah! Uh... Pepper is using the torch to see Gerald's teeth. You have very nice teeth, Mr. Gerald. So you get a sticker. Thank you. <laughs> Hooray! Well done, Pepper and Gerald. <laughs> Does anyone know a way we can look after our teeth at home? Um, but, uh, we can brush our teeth. That's right, Susie. Brushing our teeth keeps them clean. Shall we practice brushing our teeth? Yes! <laughs> Miss Rabbit is giving everyone toothbrushes so they can practice brushing their teeth. First, we get the brush wet. <laughs> <laughs> then we put some toothpaste on. Everyone is adding little dollops of toothpaste to their toothbrush. But Candy has added a big dollop. Now what do we do, class? We... Brush! <laughs> Remember to brush the front and the sides, tops and bottoms. Well done, everyone. <laughs> everyone did very well today, so everyone gets stickers. Peppa likes pretending to be a dentist, and Peppa really likes stickers. Hooray! Hello, I'm King Peppa. It's another day at Playgroup, and everyone is pretending Peppa is the king. I'm the king, and I say everyone should eat lots of yummy food. <laughs> of course, Your Majesty. Hooray! <laughs> King Pepper is enjoying being king of the playgroup. She really likes all the yummy food. I've brought you some raisins, <gasps> Mrs. King. Mm. Oh, thank you, Candy. I love raisins. Mmm. But I 
am getting very full. Um, can I be the king for a while if you're full, King Peppa? Good idea. Here you go, King Pedro. Oh. Now, Pedro Pony <laughs> is the king of the playgroup. I say everyone has to hop. Hmm. Why, Mr. Highness? Because hopping is fun. <laughs> king Pedro is right. Hopping is fun. <laughs> Very good hopping, Danny. Well, thank you, King Pedro. Hop. <laughs> King Pedro, you said everyone should hop. That means you should too. Oh, that's right. Hop, 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 hop. Would you like to be the king now, Candy? <gasps> Meow. Yes, please. Hop, hop. <laughs> <laughs> now Candy is the king. <laughs> oh, I say everyone has to be really quiet. <laughs> <laughs> now everyone has to be loud. <laughs> now quiet. <laughs> Everyone is enjoying King Candy and King Danny's rules very much. Quiet! <laughs> now! <laughs> Quiet! <laughs> oh. Oh. Now George is the king. King George says that everyone should dinosaur. Everyone loves being king of the playgroup, but everyone loves being dinosaurs even more. Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Peppa. Pe oh. <laughs> Mummy Pig is dropping Pepper off at playgroup, but Mummy Pig is also looking after baby Alexander. Ooh, my. Mind if I clean up Alexander's smelly nappy before I go, Madam Gazelle? I insist. <laughs> oh, can we help clean him up? Please! <laughs> OK. Can you pass me the nappy cream from the changing bag? <gasps> and a fresh nappy. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone likes helping yeah. Mummy Pig change baby Alexander's nap. <laughs> there, fresh as a daisy. Can baby Alexander play with us? Please! Well, I don't see why not. Hooray! Peppa is showing baby Alexander all her favourite bits of the playgroup. These are the books. <gasps> Baby Alexander likes all the books. This is the whole world. <laughs> and he enjoys spinning the globe. <laughs> and this is Madame Gazelle. Bonjour, little Alexander. Oh! But he likes Madame Gazelle most of all. Uh -huh. <laughs> Perhaps it is time for some painting. <laughs> Everyone is painting pictures of themselves, Ooh. called ah. self-portraits. I'm Peppa Paint. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. I'm Freddy. <laughs> I'm Susie. <laughs> and I'm Gerald. <laughs> well done, baby Alexander. It looks like a tasty apple. Baby Alexander's painting has reminded Peppa that it's time for lunch. It's Baby Alexander's lunchtime too. He's eating special food for babies. Here comes the train, Alexander. Choo-choo! Is Baby Alexander's food nice, Mummy? He thinks so. Oh, oh my! 
Mind if I clean Alexander up again before we head off? I insist. I'll get the bag. Oh, let's go. Oh. Everyone loves having baby Alexander at playgroup. And baby Alexander loves visiting.
Pepper and Susie are pretending to be police officers. Police, we'll help you. <laughs> Thanks, police officers. You're welcome. Now we must get back to solving crimes. Nino! Bye. Nino! Oh, my! What is it, Madam Gazelle? I think my special pen has gone missing. <gasps> this sounds like a mystery. Ah. Don't worry. Me and police officer Susie will solve the case. <laughs> Pepper and Susie are looking for clues to find the special pen. They're using a magnifying glass to make small things look bigger. Aha! Purple. That's the oh. same colour oh. as Danny oh. Dog's T-shirt. <gasps> Have you oh. seen the special pen, Danny? I don't think so. Well, we'd better take you to the police station to ask you some questions. Peppa and Susie have made a pretend police station so they can ask everyone questions about the missing pen. <laughs> it's made from books and pillows. This police station doesn't even have doors. It's a nice place to read, though. Peppa and Susie are asking everybody about the special pen. Oh. They've brought Candy Cat to the pretend police station. Candy Cat, can you Remember what colour the special pen is? Hmm, red? No, green. Actually, pink. No, uh, blue. Aha, uh -huh. you've been very helpful. Let's take a big look around. The special blue pen must be <gasps> hidden somewhere. Pepper and Susie are searching everywhere for the special pen. Ah! Oh, but they can't find it anywhere. I can't find it anywhere. Hmm, I have an idea. Now, Madam Gazelle is answering questions at the pretend police station. When did you last see your pen, Madam Gazelle? Well, let's see. I used it this morning, then I put it behind my ear. Oh, my! Yay! Madam Gazelle's special <laughs> pen has been behind her ear all along. We found it! We solved the mystery! <laughs> Hooray! Thank you for helping me, Peppa and Susie. I think you would make very good police <gasps> officers. <laughs> <laughs>